Happiness Bag is the Wabash Valley's only facility of its kind. The organization is designed for adults and children with disabilities. The number of individuals going there has grown over the years. News 10's Lacey Clifton explains how the facility plans to relieve some of those growing pains. Here in Terre Haute, Happiness Bag helps several of those with different needs, but they're needing more space and more money. Luckily, they're getting help from an outside source. Jody Moan is the executive director for Happiness Bag. She says there are plans to build another gym for various activities, an expanded kitchen for meal prep and to teach cooking, more office space for employees, and a computer lab to be used by all attending Happiness Bag. Moan says she's excited to pursue such a fulfilling project. These folks provide you with so much positivity, um, so many rewards um, that they give to you without even realizing it. Um, so if we're able to give them a little bit of something to support them and, and allow them opportunities to grow and develop, um, then that's what we're here for. After the equipment is bought for the computer lab, it will be installed by volunteers from the India Association, which has already donated $40,000. Moan says that as attendance has grown, the number of hired employees has grown as well. She says the need for additional volunteers is constant and encourages everyone to volunteer. Happiness Bag is planning a three-phase renovation project that should give them all the space that they need. In Terre Haute, Lacey Clifton, News 10. The capital campaign project will cost a total of $5 million. If you'd like to get involved with Happiness Bag's expansion project or with the organization in general, we have how you can do that on our website. It's WTHITV.com.